Welcome guys, thank you so much for joining in. So since the price of Ethereum right now is flashing a very, very interesting scenario, I thought giving you a quick update on this price action because if you look at the price action in a weekly time frame, in a weekly we have been very, very clear. Right now, the price of Ethereum could be getting gravitated towards this very, very important line of resistance that's lying around 3,900 to 4,000 price area because if we do flip this resistance into support, around this 3,900 to 4,000 range, you can see, then the price of Ethereum could be starting this new rally towards the Valhalla, guys, because we know that's also going to be a new price discovery mode. So that's why, that's why once we find a proper support above this 4,000, then I'm actually expecting some very, very parabolic move to follow for Ethereum because just like with Bitcoin, what I showed you on my today's video, guys, you can see once the resistance, previous temporary race line gets broken, the price after that has always showed some really nice impulsive movement you can see resistance right this was also a temporary race line but once the resistance got broken price saw another really nice movement here to the upside and came exactly around this 3900 to 4000 range and got a reversal again retested the previous temporary race line just like here you can see right and now we are starting this new move here to the upper direction so that's why if we do break this resistance guys and flip it into support just like here after that you can see right just like here after that we could be starting a new impulsive move for ethereum and now if you also look at this price action in a daily time frame you know this rising trend line has always been a strong line of support for ethereum and it's also showing us the possible trend duration so right now if you look at this price action of ethereum we are still following this rising trend line and we are also above it so that's why this is also a sign that this trend here could continue this rally here to the upward duration because if you look at this price movement carefully around this area you can see we could be forming an inverse head and shoulder type of scenario for ethereum and if you have watched my previous ethereum video i was talking about this inverse head and shoulder type of scenario playing out and price breaking this neckline area and starting this new trend here to the upside because we were aware from this swing low till this swing high if you look at this price pullback, you can see this retracement ended exactly at this 0.5 Fibonacci retracement line and we started this new move here to the upside. So that's why we said if this trend here is going to continue, then we are not going to look this with the help of this Fibonacci retracement, but with Fibonacci extension line because this Fibonacci extension line is going to show us the potential upward price target for ethereum here in the immediate short term and also in the upcoming days so according to this fibonacci extension line if you look at this price action you can see guys right now where we are finding resistance exactly at this 0.5 fibonacci extension line around 3800 area you can see exactly when we came there we got a rejection so for the immediate short term if we flip this 3800 resistance into support then the price of ethereum could be ready for this next movement that could bring us again towards this 4000 price area the 0.618 fibonacci extension line which is lying around 4070 price area so before choosing an actual trend direction i strongly believe the price of ethereum for the immediate short term could be heading towards this 3900 to 4000 price range and now let me also show you this another very very interesting scenario that could be playing out here in a smaller time frame but before I switch this chart, I just want to show you the inverse head and shoulder price target. If this is going to play out just like here, breaking out of this neckline, which we have already done, then if this trend is going to continue according to this inverse head and shoulder, you can see the price is exactly around this 0.786 Fibonacci extension line that is lying around 4,459 area. So with each and every price movement, these Fibonacci lines, these extension lines are also making a lot of sense for Ethereum. And now let's switch this time frame into smaller time frame. So just to make you aware, guys, this is a quick update on price action of Ethereum since many of you were asking about it. And now also please take two seconds of your time and please try to destroy that like button. And for those individuals watching this for the first time, hit that subscribe button and the bell. Now, if we look at the price action of Ethereum here in a four hour time frame, I want to show you a very, very interesting scenario that played out here, right? If you look at the price structure using this falling trend line, this falling trend line was a strong line of resistance here in a four hour time frame but once we were able to flip this resistance into support 
we started this new move here to the upward direction and as i've already said you guys with each and every price movement the previous tops are always or previous highs are always going to play an important role so in our case you can see this here right these two lines previous highs lower lows lower highs continuation pattern right you can see here this was more of a lower highs lower lows continuation pattern but once we broke out of this upper line or this falling trend line we started this new rally here to the upside and if you look at this previous high now you can see around this price range of 3600 to 2700 we were finding a strong resistance for ethereum right because we knew this was the previous high and once we broke out of it now you can see the same line which previously acted as the resistance plenty of time acted as a support here right and now we are seeing this impulsive price movement so if this impulsive price movement is going to continue then previous high another previous high is lying around this 3900 to 4000 price area so that's why right now for the media short term i am expecting the price of ethereum to continue this rally here towards this 3900 to 4000 price range before choosing and trend direction because as i've already said you if we do flip this resistance of 3900 or 4000 into support then this trend could see another very very impulsive move after that here in the upcoming days but if we do see any sort of a shakeout on our way now the same line right around this 3600 3700 which previously acted as a resistance could be acting as a support if we do see some more pullback before again trying to break here towards this 4000 price area so these are some of the quick scenarios i wanted to share with you in today's episode if you enjoyed the video please guys hit the like button and for those individuals watching this for the first time hit that subscribe button and the bell by saying this i'm signing out my name is anup bye bye guys